Welcome back everyone, this is SciTech with Tech Riot Gaming and another episode in our Planet Crafter Hardcore playthrough. Hope you're all having a good day. Today uh, we're going to do a couple of things. Um, I said I was going to do some planning for a more exciting episode. I kind of got busy, didn't do a whole lot of planning, but there is at least one thing that I want to do, um, and that is get a drill down in a uranium cave. And... Uh, go and visit the there's two uranium caves i did a little research offline um i know where they both are and um one apparently i don't know how accurate this is does a better job of producing uranium with a with a ore extractor than the other so and because i don't feel i need two ore extractors um running in a uranium caves so they'll just produce too much uranium for me um we're just gonna put one down and then we'll go visit the second cave and then when we get back, we'll figure out what we're going to do next. Um, so the first thing I need to do is gather enough resources for a ore extractor. Let's change that song. I don't like when the songs have speaking in it when I'm trying to record. Um, oh, I might not have enough osmium, actually. Of course, I changed the song to a non-vocal, and it goes to a vocal one. All right, there we go. Um... To osmium. I don't know if I have to osmium. We're gonna have to go find out. I know where to go get some more, so we might have to do a little resource run here in the beginning. Don't think I have enough osmium. Oh, I have just enough. That's funny. It right, looks like we need some water and food on us too, so we'll get that real quick. Just check the status of our eggplant here. I've been trying to keep the eggplant growing. Um, yeah, let's eat a food. Not take two food with us. Let's grab some water. I'm gonna take four water with us just because we're gonna be going out most likely. All right. Uh, what else did I need? I forgot to get the rest of what I needed for the drill. I was so excited to get my food and water. All right. Titanium, aluminum, super alloy. Okay. Titanium. Ugh. Hate when I misclick like that. Super alloy. It's gonna be down here. And a iridium rod. Just happen to have one. All right, so we got everything for our extractor. Um, okay, we'll go out and head to our first first uranium cave. Now, I kept walking right by this place. Um, didn't realize it was there. Oh, before we do this, uh, one of the viewers left a tip that I should look under this stone overhang for something special. Oh, look at that. Gold crate. Thank you, viewer, who left that message. I'm sorry, I don't remember what your name was. I apologize. Um, but that's good. I think we got two two super alloys out of that oh look at that our gas extractor i was curious to get that down and see what it does i think it does the methane cartridges but i'm not 100 percent certain on that I'll stop in here real quick uh yeah so we got three super alloy from that that was really cool and another 600 flower which is bonus some aluminum that was a good chest thank you for the tip um the viewer who left that I think it was Gamers United or something like that. I, I apologize if I just totally butchered your name. I will make sure to look it up uh, the next uh, in between episodes, and I'll mention you. Know, I'll, I'll do a shout out to you in the next episode. So we were going over there. That's where we had that other golden chest, and where we found the cave that led to the area with the crystals and the mushroom river. But it's right here through this little gap in the rocks.
come through the gap in the rocks and then right in here is our uranium cave. I'm going to try and put this thing right here. And we'll just confirm. Oh, it says iron. Hmm. I don't know why that says iron. I don't think it's supposed to say iron. I guess I can try moving it around. I'm going to run out of O2. Guess I can try putting it over here. Maybe that'll change it. I don't know. Oh, that's interesting. I don't know what to think about that. I thought putting it in here was going to give us uranium. Well, anyway, we'll just gather up all this stuff that we can find before we head back. If any of you watching know that know what the deal is with that, you know, leave a comment. I was pretty sure that putting it in here was supposed to give me um, uranium. Oh, there was a lot of uranium in here, though. It's good. I mean, the the viewer who did mention where these caves were, I uh, had a comment from them. Also mentioned that just doing the rockets is better. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know why that... I don't know why that's not producing uranium. Don't think I'm going to make it back. I might have to use my other canister. It always wants to pop me off my jetpack right there for some reason. Must be like an invisible bit of cliff hanging out there. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to make this before my O2 runs out. We might. It's going to be super close. Let's see if I can do it. <laughs> I do have enough slots to make another make my replacement O2 cartridge, so I just gotta get some cobalt. Wow, I'm super disappointed. Cause we popped that tier one or or um ore extractor in the iridium cave and we were getting iridium as the primary as a preferred ore. I'm not quite sure what to think about that. Oh yeah, let's drink some water. All right. Um, yeah, we'll head back to the base, drop off this stuff, and then we'll go to the other. Maybe I'll. Uh, maybe I'll grab enough materials um, for us to do another drill, and we'll just throw one in that other uh, uranium cave just to see if we get the same result. Uh, because people online were saying that that cave we were just in produces uranium better than the other one. I didn't think that was a thing. I thought if they produced a particular resource it was equal, but maybe that's not the case. Um, so we'll grab... I'll have to make up like a... I'll have to make up some stuff, like an ir iridium rod. Uh, but let's put some of this stuff away. Oh, I think I was full up on my uranium. Oh no. Did I use it? Oh, that's right. We used it for the uh, nuclear reactor. Oh, okay. Let's drop off this other stuff. Um, I think I only need one super alloy on me. We have a man-made chest down here where we can pop this for now. Go here. Pop our iron. Silica. Need only one aluminum, I think. Oh, I keep clicking on that name badge. Coming around the corner like that and cutting it sharp. Keep clicking on that name badge. All right, we will drop off. Let's see, I need. What do I need for that? Uh, oh, I'm out of osmium, so I'll have to go get some osmium. And we need titanium and an iridium rod. Okay. I don't think I had an iridium rod. I did not.
Okay, we'll just make one up real quick. Grab our piece of titanium. Okay, we gotta go get some osmium crystals. So we gotta do a little detour. It's okay. Just gonna drop off this 600 flower that's over here. Maybe get some food and water if we need it. Uh, flowers. Um, I have two food and three water on me. I, I mean, I guess that's... We'll go ahead and top off. Oh, the other thing that I did was um, I did drop down another water collector over here to try and off camera to try and um, make it so that we could get more get water more quickly. So we'll collect up all this water. Maybe when we get back, we'll plop down the rest of our um, flower spreaders. And I believe we can do the. Yeah, we might be a little light on super alloy, but I'm going to try and make it so we can do the last six as tier two spreaders so we can check those out. All right, we need to go get some osmium crystals. I believe I know where they are, so we're just going to have to take a little trip. <laughs> kind of, maybe I want to go this way. I think I want to go this way. I think it's a little bit faster than going the long way through the aluminum fields since we can fly over the water. Yeah, I'm really liking this playthrough so far. I mean, the early days, you obviously remember, it was stressful for me with the, the hardcore mode and the uh, burn for the oxygen, um, water, and hunger. But uh, oh, this is getting really green over here. Oh, look, there's grass. <laughs> this is our first grass I've seen. That's fantastic. I think we got all the osmium out of this cave. Oh, there's one. Oh, my inventory. Oh, I forgot to drop off my water. Oh, no. <laughs> you guys have probably been screaming at me this whole time. Drop off your water, dude. Luckily, I have a storage cabinet in here. I can drop some of this stuff off. Oh, look it. I have a bunch of osmium in here. Well, I guess we don't need to go collect it. <laughs> Oh, yay, yay, previous life me for planning that. I'm going to grab this bioplastic too. Um, I think I'm going to grab that. I can make explosive powder. We'll leave the rest of that here. I don't need the green bean seeds. Okay. That's really cool that there's plants and grass growing. The last time I played Early Access, this was not a thing. That's new for me. I like how it's getting green. I can't wait till we have trees and animals, AKA insects. I, I don't think they have any real animals. I think it's just insects, but... Yeah, there is grass there. I don't know why I didn't notice that when I flew over it the first time. I should have gone upstairs, because that's where my water is, but whatever. And it sucks, because I kind of wanted all that water here. Maybe I'll go back and grab it. Uh, because I wanted it here for doing the spreaders, but the spreaders take less water than the uh, the tier twos, so let's just drop all that off, and we'll grab a couple of water on us. That should be enough anyway. So we needed two osmium for our drill, so I'm gonna go drop off that excess, and then we'll go to the other uranium cave. We'll finish that off, and then we'll come back and do spreaders. Osmium, that's why it's dropping off. And I only need one aluminum. 
so we will drop off these three aluminum. Or did I accidentally keep one of those on me? Uh, this, 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 two of those. Okay, bioplastic. I go in my man-made for now. Oh wait, I have a bioplastic. I do have bioplastic. Just has nothing in it because I burned through it all. Okay, um, got stuff for a drill. I'm gonna have two food on me. I think I wanna grab extra water. Only because where we're going is far away from where we just dropped off all that other water, so I don't. I just want to take some extra water with us. Do not want to die for being being foolish. Okay. All right, let's go. So this other cave is in an area where I have not been yet. I apologize for it being so dark, but. My light might it doesn't really help. I should craft that tier two light. We'll do that when we get back to. Oh, it is super dark. Oh, wait a minute. Is this where that's? Uh, okay. I should have brought material for building a pod. I mean, we have some around here. I'll just grab it up real quick. Uh, silica. Just need three iron now. Um, right, give me three iron. Two. Got any more iron? It's titanium. Come on, there's gotta be some iron laying around here. Come on. To the cave. There we go. Okay, we're gonna get this just down, I think. Ah, uh, come on. Alright, perfect. I didn't see what that was. We just unlocked either, because I was too too eager to get this thing down let's see what we unlocked potentially i don't know what it is what it was oh it was our tier no we have tier four heaters i think already um wasn't our gas extractor well, i might have to go back and look in the video to see what that was that i unlocked i don't know what it was it might have been the tier four heater. Anyway, back to what we were doing. Um, this is supposedly a satellite wreck, but I don't, can we get anything out of here? Oh, holy smokes. Eggplant seeds, we needed those, that's fantastic. All right, uh, let's top off our O2 and then we'll go get into this other cave. Um, I believe it's over this way. Yes, I don't know what this region is called either, but um, it's kind of cool, especially if it gets all this like little waterway stuff. I can imagine having a base down here, you know, after you've greened up everything might be kind of cool. Here is the other uranium cave. I don't know where we should put this drill. Maybe right here. If I, can... I mean, this one says iron too. So I don't know. See if we can, there's supposed to be a yellow chest over here too. I might just burn an O2 canister so that we can try and find that. I, it, there's supposedly a yellow chest around here somewhere, but I don't know where it's at. I didn't pre-look online other than to know that there is supposed to be one over here.
any of you watching know where, oh there it is oh yes a new effigy it's fantastic and a uranium rod yep that was fantastic all right so there it is that's the uranium cave like I said this is kind of a cool area I don't know what they call this area but it wasn't here when I played last so it's kind of cool I could see having like a base nestled down in this valley would be kind of cool that is up there either we'll go check that out um how much space do i have okay i'm gonna get that o2 canister back that i used just so we keep two on us i'm gonna leave this hab here should do my little crafting station but if i ever come out here and need a crafting station there's plenty of minerals around to get it iron might be a little light but we'll find one nearby all right, let's go check this out because this looked kind of interesting. Oh, there was a cave right by here, though, too, wasn't there? Or was I just imagining that? Oh, there's iron sitting just right there. That's weird. Let's go to the sulfur area. What is this? Oh, there's super alloy in here. Um, I think I'm going to leave all that stuff. I'm going to leave this flower. Anything else I don't want on me? It w oh, I forgot to do my O2 canister. There's just super alloy laying on the ground in here. That's fantastic. Right, we'll come back in in a second. Oh, come on. Jetpack, go. Oh, there's iron right there, too. Two iron. I was looking for iron. I couldn't find it. I must have walked right by that. take stock we have two water a food we have 202 okay I'm gonna go back up here see if we can't find more super alloy then we'll come back and we'll just jaunt up this other way to see where that goes I kind of turn this into a little exploring mission instead of a uh, drilling a uranium cave mission but <laughs> hopefully you guys don't mind this is a good note for anyone looking for super alloy though because there is a lot of it laying on the ground. Well, not a lot, but there's there's good amount. And this is good because we needed some. That oh, was my inventory full. Dang it. There's two pieces right there. Uh, I'm inclined to just leave the iridium and grab the super alloy. Okay, this turned into a uh, beneficial little jaunt. Uh, let's go see where this goes. I have a feeling this goes up to the sulfur area or maybe to the, maybe to the sand falls area. Are those just red rocks? Okay, I'm gonna make sure there wasn't some new material. What? Wait a minute. What is that? Oh, my 
my goodness. I am full. I can't make a base. Uh, okay, we'll come back. Is this just its own little isolated thing? Yeah, look at that. Very cool. We will come back and explore that. I hope I can make it down here and fill up before we have to use an O2 canister. Uh, it doesn't look like we're going to make it. Come too far away. Uh, O2. All right, we will head back, drop all this luscious loot <laughs> off, and then we will come back. I might be able to shortcut through here. This should go to the uh, sulfur, sulfur area and into the iridium cave. It probably isn't any shorter. Top off our O2. That was pretty cool, that little area. I like those like stacked stones with like the little crosses on top. That look pretty cool. I think I've been missing out on this whole because this whole time we've been playing, there's been like really no story. And I think it's because I didn't build the communication array and the uh, communications terminal. So much to do. <laughs> Super alloy, I'll drop that off. Uh, man made, drop off that effigy. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'll drop those off. I have my fertilizer upstairs, but I'll drop the powder down here since I already had some in there. Iridium, uranium, water, um, turn off my light I guess, uh, aluminum, we got two uranium rods. That's fantastic. Are these ready yet? Yep, they are. Okay, we'll harvest the eggplant, get some more fertilizer. Uh, seeds. And flowers. Jeez. We'll put these two 600s in our new tier, tier 2s. When we build them. Okay. Sort that. Uh, let's get another food. Let's eat a food. Um, let's take another water with us. Actually, I'm going to be out exploring over there. So let's take... Oh, I'm actually down to my last locker of beans. That's... All right, we'll take four food. We'll take six water. Two O2s. We'll grab it. We'll grab enough minerals that we need for a pod. I'm gonna harvest these right now. Just store them in the locker until we get back, so that the more are growing. I don't have enough space. Do I have enough space over here? Looks like I do. Okay. I want to get our tier two biodomes created as well. Wait, did I just? Okay. <laughs> One, two, three. One, two. One. Okay.
Here we go. I'm gonna go check out this wreck. I probably should have brought some, at least three more iron for a storage container, but I'm hoping there'll be some out around this wreck. Oh, we're starting to get water over here now. That's cool. It's funny how we have tufts of green grass, but no green moss over this way. I said crosses. I guess these don't really look like crosses. Just stack stones. That's pretty cool, though. Got any iron in here? No iron. We'll take the super alloy. That was tier 2 fertilizer? You should take that. I'm just looking for iron there's some I don't know if this is even a very big rack or if I even needed to bother putting a putting a thing out here we'll do it anyway um, what do I have on me All right. let's see is there iron in here no iron in here either, but we'll take both of those. And we'll take the aluminum. Iron, silica. One, two. Give us two storage lockers and a crafting terminal. I'm probably building these and there'll be like one chest inside this rack. It's fine, I'll drop off some of this stuff that I already collected. And, uh,. Drop off this excess food and water to you. Okay. Let's go see what we have in here. Did I dismantle this? Nope. Did I dismantle this? Nope. These look like giant storage containers. Gosh, there'll be nothing in here. Oh. These are open on the side. that a solar panel? Hmm. You definitely don't want to be caught in here with no O2 or water. Like, getting out of these things seems like it would be problematic. Satellites? I mean, that's cool, but... Are these tipped up on their sides? Wow, I cannot see a thing. One canister, what'd I say? <laughs> Got some, we'll just take everything, what the heck. Oh, we're about to be out of O2. Is there any way to go? 
It doesn't appear to be. There's a crate. We had two crates. We'll take an engine. That'll help with our rockets. Okay. Don't know how I missed that crate the first time. Can I... Okay, there's a heater we can deconstruct. Got to be a little careful on our O2. I don't know what these things are. Can't seem to get in there though. This is the back. Let's look up here. Okay, we have a crate. Hmm. Let's drop off the silica, take the super alloy, leave the lerma. Yeah, that looks good enough. Now we gotta try and get out of here. Might be something up there, we'll come back. Drop off. Stuff we don't need. Okay. Let's come over here. Do a water and a food. Mm, I want to replace that O2 canister that we used. Just grab some cobalt. Of course, it's nighttime. I guess these things are here so you could walk up here if you didn't have the jetpack, I guess. Oh, look at that. It says dismantle. That was kind of cool. Anything else in here that I can dismantle? Doesn't appear to be so. Some satellites. Wait, deconstruct wreck? What did I just deconstruct? Oh, wow. Can you deconstruct the end of these containers? Uh, can't deconstruct that. Can't deconstruct this. Go out and refill our O2 so we don't have to use a canister. How full are we? We're pretty full. I keep hitting the wrong button. Got iridium rods from those heaters. That was fantastic. Super alloys and bioplastic. We'll take that. Oops. I can't believe I missed that crate the first time. Did I just not look at it? Um, these are all open. Can I make any. That's like all the way up at the ceiling. I can't get to that one. I guess I don't think I can. Yeah, there's no way to deconstruct that. Oh, did I just find another chest? Oh, that was the one we had before. I just didn't finish it off. Because we were full. Okay, yeah, I can't definitely not get on top of that. 
this one is already open. I don't think I can do anything with this. Nope. Okay. I think that's it. I have to use an O2 canister, it's fine. I think that's it for this wreck. I should look around the wreck though to see if we have a yellow canister or a yellow container. Let's take all that. Oh wow, full. Oh, let's take that. Let's put that. Silica here. I'm trying to keep like things with like thing. We'll grab that bioplastic, grab that fertilizer, grab that osmium. Should probably bring these two 400 flowers back with us, but we have plenty. So I think I'm going to leave them here for now. Uh, grab that. I drink this. Don't really need to eat this food just yet. I'll leave it in here. I'm going to bring all these super alloys back with us. We'll drop off the iron. Take that. Get another bag of fertilizer. I don't need all of these Lerma. Oops. I don't need that 200 either. Let's grab the engine. Tier 2 fertilizer. Okay. You just got to remember I only have one O2 canister on me, so... Yeah, a fair amount of material left over here. Yeah, got a lot of aluminum. I wish I could bring that with me, but the super alloy is more important. We have the aluminum fields with two drills in it right near us, so we can get a fair amount of aluminum. Let's go check this chest out over here. And then I'm full up on my aluminum. I mean, full up on my inventory. I was thinking aluminum when I said inventory. Um, man, good stuff in here, too. Yeah, we're just going to have to come back. Uh, maybe I'll come back later off camera and get all this stuff that's out here. For now, I'm just going to double check that we don't have any gold crate on top of this or around this. They like to tuck them inside like crevices and stuff, so I'm just gonna look real quick. Don't see any. Much water. We got two water, two food. We got another water in here too, so. Just gonna kind of check around these rock pillars and stuff. Get another blue crate. Ugh. Good stuff in there too. Where does this go? Looks like a cave with ice. That has melted. Is it Osmium Cave? Where does this go? Pulsar quartz? 
Where does this go? This is one giant dead end? Oh, that sucks. I was hoping it would come out somewhere. I mean, it's cool. I found a cave with pulsar crystals. You know where to get some of those now. And some osmium. Ah, oh, two super alloys in there too. Uh, we're gonna have to use our last O2 canister. Not gonna be able to get back to our pod. Alright, well that's cool to know that that's down there. Guess we can just head out. Just gonna try and pop over here just to kind of see. Looks like there might be something in there. Oh my gosh, it's a zeolite cavern. I don't have the O2 to mess around though, so we have to... Oh, that's on top of the sand waterfalls. All right, we're going to head over here to refill our O2 because I was messing around too much. So there's a zeolite cavern and a pulsar quartz cavern. Good to know. Should have left that food in there, food and water in there, and just used what was on me. That's okay. That was really cool that that uh, zeolite cavern is over there. That's really cool to know that. I mean, I could probably drop down over here to get back. They probably can't fly up it. But it looks like I could definitely drop down it. <laughs> We'll have to try going up that way next time instead of going all the way around. I didn't think you could fly up over that sand waterfall. I have no O2 on me, so we gotta be... I'd hate to die because I was being stupid. Well, that little jaunt turned into a 45 minute exploration episode. <laughs> That's okay, I kinda owe you guys. We'll maybe do a little bit longer episode today. All right, let's go dump all this stuff off. I think the only thing that goes on up here is a 400 flower, which I have just enough room for. Oh, that's full. Okay, we'll put the rest of this in the man-made chest. How are these guys doing? Mm. Eggplants are ready to go. Means we can make more fertilizer. We should have enough to do um, our flower spreaders and our biodomes, which is really cool. All right, let's go drop off our super alloy. It's good. I'm glad I'm replenishing that. Uh, bioplastics. Are there man-made is down here go ahead and stick those there stick the engine there all right osmium wow we got a lot of iridium rods from that that was really cool it saves me a lot of gathering iridium we have enough rods now for another tier 2 nuclear reactor. How's our power doing? We dropped a couple of drills. 5, 6, 7, 8, so about 400? 
ish. 400 ish. And what are these going to take? Forty three power a piece. Uh, six is two forty. Okay, we'll go put these spreaders down. Um, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. And then I need 12 water as well. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. 2, 4, 6. All right, that's fine. We'll do that. Um, sorry, I was just trying to figure out what I could carry um, so we can make these. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And we've got our fertilizer upstairs and water outside. I'll have to come back in for the flowers, but that's fine. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. The rest we'll grab in water. Won't be enough. But we can grab the rest from our collectors. All right. Um, do I want to put these just like right next to each other? Wow, these are big. Let's see. Overlap them a little bit. here I know this might not work because it's gonna be spraying it on the base but two three four I guess I can turn around oops I'll miss some water oh shit That could have been being stupid right there. Uh, one, two, three, four. One, two. Okay. Of these down. Let's see. So like right on the edge of that one, kind of like doubling them up a little bit. This one's going to be edged out like right here. What did I put down? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Let's go get our flowers. the highest producing flowers in our highest tier flower spreaders that's why I'm replacing these I did put one in here right yeah okay 
All right, we got two in there. So this one, let's do that. This one, that. There we go. 1.95 PPT per second. Wow, why are they taking so much? Oh, I thought they were taking 40 energy. They're taking 38.8. Alright, well, that's less energy than I thought it was going to be, so yay. Okay. Um, what to do now? Let's just double check our power. Like 160. Should probably pop down another nuclear reactor. Let's check our numbers for doing those flower spreaders. Oxygen is definitely cranking up pretty good. Our heat's still going up decently, but that's one hundredth of a point. So maybe we want to think about doing something with heat. Our pressure is kind of in the same place. <laughs> These numbers look better now, though. So our pressure is at twenty thousand. That tier four drill did amazing things for that number. Let's check something here. Um, my tier three heaters are putting out 28.5 heat. Oh my good God. <laughs> 28.5 versus 538. <laughs> uh, I mean, one of these is equal to twice as many of these that I have deployed right now. That's crazy. Uh. Okay, we're gonna try something here. Let's see, what do I need for this? Iron and cobalt. Um. I was thinking I kind of screwed myself with glassing in those uh, heaters, but I think I might be able to put a ladder. Maybe. I'm not sure. If I can kind of. I don't know if I can. I was hoping I could. Ugh. Doesn't look like it's gonna let me place it through the glass. So bad. Um, oh, but I know what I can do. Uh, let's see. Where do I have the most room? Do I lose all of the stuff that's in there if I deconstruct this compartment, or... Mm. I don't want to deconstruct the one I'm standing in. Let's do it from outside. See if we can do it from outside. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I just did that again. <laughs> oh, you guys are gonna just laugh and cheer and be crazy every time I do that because this is probably like the third or fourth time I've done it in video. <laughs> and I don't edit it out because it's me, right? It represents me, so. <laughs> All right. All right, let's see if we can do something here. I don't, can I get high enough to, ooh, what is that? 
I did not know you could do that. I did not know you could fly up. Oh, I just learned something new. Oh, it says something inside. I wonder if... Okay. Now, do I have enough for this? Oh, I need silicone. Give me some silicone. <laughs> I wonder if I can do this. Uh oh, what am I low on? Water, that's fine. Let's go top off our O2 real quick before I try this. I did it. You gonna have enough space? I don't think I'm gonna have enough space. Uh, but I should be able to put my corner piece in here again, and then I'll have a permanent doorway into here, which means I don't have to, you know, I just have some glass walls in here, whatever, that's fine. Um, I don't think I have enough space to deconstruct all of these looks like there's four slots I can do one more. All right, let's go put the rest of the stuff away uh, I can't deconstruct the door though that's the but I can deconstruct the compartment and I can get it back and then I can put the compartment back without the door and then put the windowed piece back in or the cornered piece back in uh, so let's do that where did this start right here I think so instead of sorting and making this easy on myself I'm just gonna because um, I can do all of those for sure cobalt iron okay I actually can sort this it looks like Titanium, silicon, aluminum. Titanium, silicon, aluminum. Just gotta remember that. Silica. Titanium. Uh, aluminum. Okay. Let's fix this. this okay now we should have a open pathway almost did that uh, deconstructing that ladder again almost perfect all right now we can work on these tier 4 heaters oh my gosh <laughs> I swear I'm not doing it on purpose, y'all. I swear. <laughs> oh boy. The number of times I've had to redo this ladder. <laughs> I've lost count. Uh, fun times with SciTech. <laughs> Why do I have excess cobalt? That's interesting. Huh. Okay. Whatever. That's fine. Uh, cobalt. Uh, silica. Titanium. Aluminum. Back into our second container of aluminum, so that's good. Um, all right, tier four heaters. 
two iridium rods and explosive powder. Well, we have a lot of explosive powder, so we don't have to worry about that. Um, we have a fair amount of super alloy too, so I guess it's going to be iridium rods that are going to dictate how many of these we do. Oh my gosh, we have a lot of iridium rods. Two. Uh, three. So let's see how much super alloy we want to actually use on this. Keep three. One, two, three, four. I guess I'm okay doing five. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Sure. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so now we need. Okay. Do I have enough space to carry it all? I do. Fantastic. Okay. Um, can we build these tier 4 heaters outside or do they got to be built inside? Oh, they can be outside. Hmm. Changes things up. I can't carry enough. Mm. All right, that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna drop these explosive powders back off. We're gonna pick up a bunch of iron. Let's see. I was gonna do drills out here along that way. I've got nuclear reactors up there. Um, let's. Do let's try and do our heaters here, maybe. Let's see if we can get this kind of close. Gotta be careful of this rock because I can't build stairs into that rock, so I wanna make sure I have stairs going up to this. I put that how much is this costing? I thought these only cost one iron. Huh. This is easier to do from the ground for some reason. Uh are you kidding me? That boulder right there is keeping me from putting uh storm right now. It's so bad that that rock is in the way. Alright, we'll go with that. I don't know exactly how big these things are, um, but I guess I should keep that iron on me just in case. I need one, two, three, four, five. Okay, that's enough. water on me okay actually let me just go grab some I don't know how long it's gonna take me to organize and line up these things so I want to make oh I don't have enough room Ugh. okay we'll go get the first couple down then I'll grab some water wish it wasn't sandstorming at the moment These fit on these fit on one platform. Not really. Okay. They're gonna work like our nuclear reactors, I guess. Let's 
that. <laughs> they have different designs. That's kind of cool. I wasn't didn't realize that. Um, let's see, I'm gonna put that there. Okay, so now I need what one four eight twelve no three four eight need eight more iron. We'll go get some water. We'll see how how this affects our heat after we finish this. Go get our eight iron. Hopefully, I have enough iron. Oh my gosh, I hate when I do that. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh my gosh, we have just enough. Fantastic. I mean, we have plenty of drills around, so I probably could have gone and gotten more, but I really wish I could build a platform here. That's kind of poo poo. Okay. And there's our new heaters. Let's go see what that did for us. Our heat. 113,000. Yep. I'd say that kind of boosted that quite a bit. Considering the rest of these are 25,000 and 21,000. <laughs> we need some more tier 4 drills. Those things are expensive as hell, though. Twice as expensive. Six. I don't have. I only have three super alloys left. I can go get more that we that we that we got when we were uh, doing our exploring. Uh, but I guess I can make three right now. We'll get another tier four drill down. We'll see how much that boosts us. So right now our pressure is at twenty five eight fifteen. Oh, and I'm. I think I'm. I think I'm down a rocket too on the pressure side. I don't remember now. I lost count of which the number of each one that I put down. Um, let's do this. Uh, one, nope. One, two, three. Oh, I don't have enough iron. I'll have to go get some iron. Titanium. One, two, three. Uh, magnesium. Three, silica, three, cobalt, one, two, three, what am I missing? One, two, three, four, oh, I think that's it. Oh, or iron, that's right. Perfect. I 
grab that? Okay. Just wanted to make sure I grab that. I didn't think I clicked on it. Alright. Another tier 4 drill. We're running out of space for tier 4 drills. <laughs> These things are beasts. Okay, so we were at what? 25,800 and some. I'm surprised our power lasted after dropping that down in all those heaters. I didn't even think about that. How did our power last? Oh, <laughs> six kilowatts to spare. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, right. I keep doing the math myself when it's right here in big numbers. <laughs> you guys are like probably all like, why does he keep thinking about it? It's like right there. Um, I don't have any food on me, so I better be careful about that. Um, so let's see, we're at 28,000 on the pressure. Yeah, I mean, that boosted us 11,000. Look at that MT, look at that terraformation index cruising up there. That's fantastic. All right, where are we at? We're in an hour and 16 minutes. I told you we'd do a little longer. So one thing I want to do is get our biodome tier twos done. And I think I want to put those. How many floors do I have on this thing? One, two. Yeah, we'll just come off the top and then maybe we'll put one. What is this music? It's crazy. Let's get something that's a little less stressy. Okay. Perfect. That's way better. Um. Yeah, let's come off of this. I kind of popped that bio lab there and I think what I want to do is to maintain symmetry here. So I might put a double, double glass corners to make a little ha round half right there. And then we'll come off of this by one one space and then do another one and then do kind of the t-shape or the, cr the cross-shaped hallway again and run the two tier two biodomes off of that i think that's what we're gonna do let me go get my food situation taken care of before i forget and die in a stupid fashion it'd be really bad to die right now just gonna grab these eggplants want to keep do an eggplant as much as I can because I know we need fertilizer for a lot of things. Uh, we're into this food crate already, so I should probably harvest my beans. Yeah, let's go harvest my beans. Orbital informations panel. We got some panels to make too. Maybe I should do those. All right, we'll get our tier two biodomes down. We'll do our communications array and we will do um, any remaining panels that we have to make. And so that means I need to get another tier two uh, nuclear reactor down, but we have enough rods for that, I think. Um, so let's get our beans put back. That's fine, we'll carry one extra bean on us, not a big deal. Water I'm just gonna top off on. All right, we need to go get, we need to go hit up our miners. Sorry, not our miners. I keep saying miners, but they're ore extractors. We need to go hit those up and gather all the iron we can get out of all of them. So I'm not going to waste time getting any other resources except maybe aluminum from these over here. I'll get aluminum and iron. What is that? Is there a zeolite crystal over here? What the heck? Is that wood? Okay. I, that was crazy. That's my first large plant type thing I've seen. Other than just things of grass. This is the first zeolite I think I've ever found out there in that gem field. Or that uh, resource field.
that was kind of cool. I mean, we've flown this route like a thousand times, so that must have just, there's another one. These must just be, yeah, look at that. It's a root, same as before. That's crazy. I like it, it's cool. <laughs> there's another one. That's awesome. All right, well, let's drop off this aluminum and zeolite and then we'll get some of the titanium we need. Uh, this is aluminum. Putting those two drills in the aluminum field was key. I, I burned so through so much aluminum and just being able to fly over there, grab it, it's keeping me up to, up to snuff. That plus the wreckage exploration, uh, zeolite. Okay, let's see what I need for these guys. Cobalt and titanium. So I need two cobalt, two titanium. Two cobalt, two titanium. One, two, three, four. Four titanium. So six titanium and two cobalt. Okay. Don't know if I have enough. Two, four, six. Okay, I do. Alrighty, let's go do this. You guys are gonna have a long episode today. All right, this is where I wanted to do this, but I don't think I can do this through the building. Now that I think about it, I think I gotta do this from outside. Oh. That's fantastic that you can do that from inside. Although I can't see what's going on. Yeah, look at that. Perfect. Okay, now. Okay. So now we'll put our tier two biodomes off of there. So let's see what we need for these guys. Uh, two fertilizer, two bacteria. Oh, I need some super alloy. So I need to get a couple super alloy. What do I need for bacteria? We got plenty of stuff for that. So let's make our black bacteria first. Um, three water, three algae. Let me see what my algae storage is looking like. All right, we'll go collect it outside and then we'll grab the water from outside too. Uh, yeah, we're not gonna be able to collect all this algae because there's gonna be more than I can fit in my inventory, but we'll collect what's out here. Kind of replenish the storage. I burn through a bit of it doing fertilizer gotta watch my hydration inventory full okay once I can get some plant rockets up too I think that's gonna help with uh, that number for uh, oxygen and plant so biomass and oxygen, I think, will be helped. Um, man, we just need so much super alloy for those tier four drills. It's a little crazy. All right, uh, let's drop off this algae. I need a three and three. I need a, what do I need for those? Three, six, nine, twelve. Three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Three, four, five, six, seven. Three, 
three, six, nine, twelve, three, six, nine, twelve. Okay. Go make the biomass we need. I mean the. What what's it called? Um. Bacteria. So one, two, three, four. Okay. Wait, two super alloy. Four fertilizer. Drop off this excess water. Just enough fertilizer, that's fantastic. All right, so now we need two super alloy and two sulfur. Pretty sure we're out of super alloy. We are. And we got plenty of sulfur, I believe. Well, not plenty, but we have enough. All right, um, silica, one, two, I said we needed two, right? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, oh, let me magnesium. Okay. Okay, I'm going to do this from outside just so I can make sure I get these placed properly. Uh, why is this? Oh, holy smokes. I got to I got to way back up to get this thing to snap. Come on. There we go. Oh, I forgot about my needing to make my power. All right, we'll do that next. We're not critical. Some food. Didn't even look to see how much power these things te took. But putting down another tier two nuclear reactor will cover it. So let's see what we need for that. Um, three rods, explosive powder. Okay. Three rods. Explosive powder. Um, cobalt, titanium, silica, magnesium, iron, and aluminum. Okay. Ugh, I need four iron. Probably don't have it. Uh, let's go check our drill over here. I mean, I don't need it to make the reactor, but I need it to make the platform that the reactor is going to sit on. Hopefully between the sulfur one and this one, we have four iron in here. One, two, three... Oh, look at that. It's another zeolite crystal. Those things probably never grow back either, and I'm just, like, harvesting them all and whatever. I have storage. I'll sit in there until I need them. <laughs> Let's just top off our O2. Let's drink some water. Please have some iron. Okay. You know what, I'm gonna grab that sulfur too. Okay. All righty, getting things done. Uh, 
Yeah. Gotta keep an eye on my O2. I get. Like I said, we'll come and make this look like it's not floating in a little bit. Uh, okay. I guess I didn't need to do that extra row on there, but whatever. It's fine. I'll be there when I need to make the next one. What am I missing? Uh, water. Of course. Okay, let's go check out our new biodomes. <laughs> These are awesome. Oh, what is this? Wait, you get tree bark from these things? <laughs> I thought this was something we had to like grow later and get from like the tree spreaders or something. Wow, that's fantastic. I, when these were in the game when I played, this was not a thing. So that they were just decorative when I played before. So uh, that's pretty cool. I like that they generate tree bark for us. Does it do it on both sides? Seed spreader rocket. All right, we're gonna do one more thing. Before I call this an episode, we are going to go over and check out all the new rockets we've unlocked because I don't remember them all and I want to see what they do. <laughs> okay, so the plant rocket does plants multiplier by a thousand. And the seed spreader. Oh, there's the oxygen multiplier. Okay. Neither one of these are that terrible to build I mean that fertilizer takes a bunch of material to build and the lerma seeds as far as I know are limited in quantity I don't know of any way to generate lerma seeds uh, maybe that's something that comes later just like the bark we just unlocked as being generated maybe the lerma seeds can be generated too from something A super alloy rod we don't have unlocked yet so we can't do either one of those we already have a tier 2 satellite okay cool beans wonder if I could get a good picture of our of our new domes and stuff I'll just say making progress or something let's see okay perfect All right, everyone. Well, I appreciate you hanging out with me today for an extra bit of period of time. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed the episode. I enjoyed having you here. Until I see you in the next one, enjoy your gaming, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye-bye.